Hey little boy, hey little girl, let's come and join me to create things with our own hands. With let's make friends. Hey everyone, welcome back to Let's Make Friends. Today we're going to be making an elephant. Before we start, I just want to thank everyone for listening and watching our video here. We've been making a handful, but getting started, we're actually going to make an elephant for the day, so we'll jump in. You can see I'm pointing out, you're going to need a pair of scissors. There's seven pipe cleaners here that are gray, but you're going to need more, so I'll let you know that up front. We're going to need a white pipe cleaner, but we're just using part of that, and then we're going to need a pencil to do coils, which is something that we do in a handful of other videos. Before we get really started started, do feel free to like our video if you like it and hit the subscribe button too, because we're always looking for subscribers. And as we begin, we're just going to fold over one gray pipe cleaner here. This is basically making the spine, tail, and snout of our elephant. So what we're turning here is actually going to be our tail going down the line, you want to kind of measure out how long you want the snout to be, the trunk. Ours is actually going to be pretty short, so we're not going too hard with it, but you'll see here we go through that. Ultimately, we're going to leave it open a little at the end, but we'll actually push it down a little bit just because there's a little more involved with putting more pipe cleaners on the body here too. Now that we have the spinal portion done, we're actually going to coil a body on here. But first step is actually making a neckline and a headline. So we're going to make this first bump and then curl a bit up so we have our neck. And then from there, we're actually going to coil the body on here all the way down to a tail space as well. Moving forward, there's going to be a lot of coiling here, so I will speed things up as we go, but just to show off a little bit, this is what we're going, and you can kind of see where we cap off before turning around and coming back the other way. Okay, so if you're still with us now that we've spent that time coiling everything on there, we're going to make the head. So grab your pencil, you're going to make a small coil. This one's going to be really tight, so you're keeping everything together this way as well. And then we're going to actually throw this over the trunk. That's why we pushed it together, to let you know too for the nose of the trunk on this. But push the coil as close together as possible here to make the head, and then we'll just slip it right on. So from here, I'm going to fill out the body a little more to get a little rounder and make a little bit of a neck too for our elephant here. So wrapping around, we're going to coil a bit here. We're going to actually coil on that neck section too, which one will actually help keep the head in place there too, but it, it does help fill it out too. So after that, we'll add more to the body because it is an elephant and we need a little bit of a bigger body for him as well.
from here, about five minutes in, and we're actually going to make the legs. And this is the complicated part, I would say, too. So going, we're going to coil it the feet, which is what I'm doing here. Use your pencil, similar to the head. You're going to keep it tight and coiled together, and then we're going to actually stem the pipe cleaner up. And that will give us a leg line that we'll add to as well. You're just going to curve it over. For the most part, when you're making these legs up front, we're actually making kind of guidelines for ourselves just to know what we're dealing with so we can add more filler pipe cleaner on towards the legs and then better attach them too. But going along here, you're going to keep using your pencil to coil on this, and this will give a good reference point for the front legs. So first making the hind legs, that's kind of the stronger legs for us on this, and then the front legs shortly after. Now in order to secure the legs, we're going to take another pipe cleaner and we're actually going to truly tighten it to the body here. One nice thing is, this will also fill out the body a little better too, but first we're starting with the front legs. This is the easier one to do. Essentially you're just going from behind and wrapping around, doing kind of a figure eight to keep everything together that way so it gives us our front leg structure. 
and the high legs were actually going to go a little more aggressively on massing the pipe cleaner around that just to fill up because usually, at least in theory, the pipe cleaner should be thicker on the bottom half. I'm going to make an elephant butt while we go through this and that'll connect to the tail here. As you can imagine, with our elephant almost done, we have to make our ears, which is one of the key things about elephants. In order to do it relatively simple, you're actually just going to take one pipe cleaner and we are going to make a coil on one side. Not the same coil as before, it's more of a flat coil. And then we do it to the other side as well. You don't need to go all the way on this because the main thing is just making sure we know how it's going to line up. So as we go through, you're just kind of coiling the flat line here, almost like a fiddlehead, and then we're going to place that on and better secure it. And our final step, we are going to make some tusks, just little tusks for our little elephant here. Using a pipe, white pipe cleaner, we're actually going to snip those, snip in half to, so I'll grab that one after here as well. But we will actually just stick it into the head. This is probably the easiest part of making an elephant, to be honest. Uh, very simple, you just cut off a little nub for the tusk and then you can actually stick it right into the head there. There's plenty of room to plug it in. And voila, there's our pipe cleaner elephant. So once again, if you like our channel, please, please hit the subscribe button. If you like our videos, please like our videos as well. Uh, and keep tabs, we make these videos weekly. Every Sunday they'll be released. And that is our Let's Make Friends elephant.